you need a crucial piece of information buried deep within a maze of documents. Scouring endless folders and sifting through pages sounds like a nightmare, right? Well, what if you could just have a conversation with your computer and get the answer instantly? NVIDIA, Chat RTX, an AI trained on your specific files, emails, and images, so you can ask questions in plain English and get results in seconds. That solves that searching your files with lightning speed. But is that all? Fortunately, no. Chat RTX, capable of so much more, and in this video, we'll be going over just that. Plus, showing you how to use this mighty tool in the first place, of course. Overview NVIDIA, Chat RTX, is a groundbreaking desktop AI tool leveraging RTX GPUs to run generative large language models LMS locally. Despite being in alpha, it's freely available, catering to developers and enthusiasts. While powerful, it's early in development, with noted instability and limitations. To install, ensure your system meets the requirements. NVIDIA, Force RTX 30 or 40 series GPU, 16 gigabytes RAM, Windows 11, NVIDIA, Drivers 535.11 and 12 gigabytes free disk space. No internet is required for operation, but a stable connection is advised for download. Check compatibility, then download from the link in the description. Installation process. After downloading, install an NVIDIA Chat RTX using the default directory to avoid operational issues. During installation, a web server and Python instance necessary for local operation will be set up. If your system has an RTX GPU, the setup will optimize settings automatically for AI model performance. Launch via desktop shortcuts or the start menu ignore any command prompt messages. Maximize hardware potential with these steps for smooth operation. Exploring the features and capabilities. The interface of Ch Chat RTX is streamlined for ease of use. Let's explore each element starting from the top. In the upper left corner of the NVIDIA Chat RTX interface, you'll notice the AI model selection area, prominently featuring a drop-down menu. This is where you can choose from the available AI models, with Mistral being the default option. The Mistral model, part of the foundational models, NVIDIA, excels at understanding and generating text based on extensive training datasets. It's particularly adept at tasks requiring a blend of creativity and analytical processing, such as drafting articles or generating descriptive content. This makes it a versatile choice for users needing a broad range of textual generation capabilities. Below the Mistral model in the drop-down menu, you'll find the Clip model. The Clip, developed by OpenAI, is renowned for its ability to understand and generate responses based on visual content. This model uses advanced image recognition technologies to analyze photos and graphics without needing metadata, allowing it to interpret images directly and respond to queries about them. This capability is incredibly useful for tasks that involve sorting or analyzing visual data, making Clip invaluable for graphic designers, digital marketers, and content creators. The second drop-down menu under the AI model selection is where you can add additional models to your setup. One notable option here is ChadGlom, a model optimized for Chinese language conversations, though it also supports English. This model is designed to cater to bilingual environments and is particularly useful for businesses or users frequently interacting in both Chinese and English. On the right-hand side of the interface, you see a power button to end the current session. Right under that, one can find the options to select and manage the dataset with which the AI interacts. This menu typically provides two main options using the default dataset that comes with the AI model or selecting a folder path to use custom data stored on the user's computer. The default dataset is what the AI initially uses to generate responses based on the generic training it received during the model's development. This dataset includes a wide variety of content types and topics, offering broad but less personalized responses. However, the true power of Chat RTX shines when users leverage their datasets. By selecting the Folder Path option, users can point the AI to specific directories on their computers. Once a folder path is selected, Chat RTX scans the content of the directory, creating an indexed dataset that the AI can query in response to user inputs. This indexing process involves parsing the documents for understandable content and converting them into a format that the AI can efficiently query. The system supports various file types including text documents, PDFs, and even images thanks to its multimodal capabilities. An essential feature within this dataset management area is the Refresh Dataset button. This functionality is crucial when new documents are added to the folder, as it allows the AI to re-index the updated content, ensuring that the responses remain relevant and accurate. Moving toward the bottom, you encounter the interactive section where users directly engage with the AI. 
The text input field is where users type their queries or commands to the AI. This straightforward interaction mimics the simplicity of chatting with any modern digital assistant. Don't feel like typing? Chat RTX offers an alternative way to interact voice input. This feature uses advanced speech recognition technology powered by Whisper. Whisper excels at converting your speech into text, making it ideal for users who prefer speaking or want a hands-free experience. Just keep in mind that you'll still need to click the send button after speaking your question. Anyhow, Whisper also supports multiple languages, so you can chat with ChatRTX in your preferred tongue. Last but not least is the green colored send button, but it's pretty self-explanatory, I think. Let's try it now. Let's say I'm a financial analyst who needs to extract specific data from numerous reports. I'll first add a folder containing multiple financial documents. Using the text input field, let's type the query summarize the key financial metrics from Q3 reports. Alternatively, we could press the voice input button and simply state the command aloud. Upon pressing the send button or completing the voice command, chat RTX processes the documents in the designated folder. Utilizing its comprehensive AI capabilities, it analyzes the text, identifies key financial metrics, and presents a concise summary directly in the chat interface. It also links the file from the folder it used to address the specific query. This functionality, indeed, not only saves time but also enhances the accuracy of data retrieval and analysis. But with numerous AI models and platforms available, why would someone choose ChatRTX? The value beyond local file search. Thanks to Tensor LLM and RAG technology, ChatRTX delivers real-time responses without internet dependency. Privacy is ensured as data processing occurs locally, safeguarding sensitive information. No user data is stored post-session, aligning with privacy best practices. Plus, ChatRTX handles coding and general queries akin to ChatGPT, all for free. With these features, it's hard to lose out. If you liked the video, please consider subscribing and sharing so we can keep bringing more content like this. See you next time.